Hey there football fans, welcome back to Football News Center. Today we've got some intriguing news coming out of Nottingham Forest regarding John Joe Shelby's exit from the club. It seems there are some questions surrounding the circumstances of his departure according to recent reports, Nottingham Forest terminated John Joe Shelby's contract before he joined Turkish club Kaker Rispor on a free transfer. This is in contrast to the club's initial statement that Shelby had left on loan. In fact, the club had even posted on their official channels that Shelby had completed a season-long loan move to Kaker Rispor. However, it turns out that the move was permanent. So, what happened? Well, it appears that Forrest had originally planned for Shelby to join Kaker Rispor on loan. But they soon realized that this would exceed the number of players they are allowed to have out on loan. FIFA rules state that clubs can only loan out a maximum of seven players at any given time. To avoid breaching this rule, Forrest decided to rescind Shelby's contract instead. Now, John Joe Shelby had made eight appearances for Forrest since joining from Newcastle last January, but he hadn't been included in a matchday squad since April. Since his move to Kaker Rice Spore, the 31-year-old has played 13 times and even scored a fantastic goal from the halfway line in a 1-0 win against Istanbul Spore. As for Nottingham Forest, they have yet to respond to requests for comment on this matter. But that's not the only thing they have to worry about. The club is also at risk of a potential points deduction if they are found to have breached the Premier League's profitability and sustainability rules. Everton, for example, were handed a 10-point deduction earlier this season for the same reason. It remains to be seen how Nottingham Forest will navigate these challenges, but one thing is for sure, this situation has certainly raised some eyebrows. We'll keep you updated on any further developments regarding John Joe Shelby and Nottingham Forest. That's all for today's news, folks. Make sure to like and subscribe to Football News Center for more exciting updates. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.